Okay. Hi, right, I'm here with a, uh, this is a 2006 Nissan Sentra 2.5 engine, and I'm removing the valves. Uh, what I did was I made a, uh, tool using the C-clamp. Probably have to use a uh, C-clamp spring compressor, but I made one with the old, uh, oxygen sensor socket one with this wide uh, opening here um, I just like I cut it in half and kind of pinched the, uh, the insides down a little bit so the bites onto the um, to these very small uh, valves from caps here and on the other side I put a uh, this is a uh, sway bar link bushing just to uh so I won't damage the um the valve and I just slowly clamp uh turn the clamp and it pushes down on the uh spring or underneath the uh the solid part of the C clamp holds the valve up and uh I'm able to get the um these uh, clips here, very small clips out with a magnet. Um, I don't, I can't really show you how I, how I clamp it down, but I can show you the. Uh, I've gotten these all the exhaust valves off, except for the last one. So I figure I uh, show you how to. How I'm doing this so I'm gonna do the same on the uh, intake side uh, to remove the valves okay in here you can see okay there it is I've compressed the uh, spring and those Uh, pieces there uh, ready to come out with the magnet so I get my magnet just stick it in there and uh, out they come and just be careful when you uh, when you uh, Take the uh, clamp off. You get un uh, turn it off slowly, also, so that it doesn't fly out. Uh, I'm hoping the same procedure can be used to install. It's the first time I've made a valve spring compressor, so I'll make another video of me installing the uh, valves after I uh, grind the seats in the uh, in the valves.